Sherry. Welcome to the Orchard Corset video series, Corset 101. In this video, we're going to show you how to bi-directionally lace your corset, which is the traditional method for lacing up a corset. Now, if you've ordered from Orchard Corset in the past, you know that we not only individually and professionally wrap your corset, but we also send it to you already bi-directionally laced. So why would you need to know how to do this? Well, what if you wanted to change laces? It turns out that we have these beautiful double-sided satin laces available in about 10 different colors. We also have extra strength paracord lacing that we have available in five colors at Orchard Corset. Also, the, when the corset comes laced, it comes with the loops, the pull loops, right here at the center where the waist tape is. And that works for most people, but not for all of us. Some people have their natural waistline that sets a little higher or a little lower. And so you might want to move your loop up or down a set of grommets. So today we're going to show you how you can do that. You begin by grabbing the ends of your lace. And for this overbust corset that we have here, this is the CS411 in emerald green overbust, you will want to have an eight foot or eight yards, excuse me, eight yards worth of lace. So you take your two ends and you pull it up through the bottom of your top grommet. These little steel circles in the back of your corset are called grommets. This corset has an even number of grommets, which is why I started up through the bottom. If I had an odd number of grommets in this corset, I would want to start from the top. You pull it through, making sure that your lace is even. And you work from one side to the other. I'm going to take the end of my lace and I'm going to go over the top and down through this grommet on the other side. And I'm going to do the same on this side, over the top and down through the grommet. Which creates that X at the back of your corset. All right. Now as we work our way back across the corset, I'm here. I'm going to come up and underneath on my next grommet. And on the other side, come diagonally across and underneath. All right, we're ready to make the next X. We come up and over the top again. Always working diagonally. So we get to the loops. other side. And we're going to continue in this fashion until we get to the center of the corset. Alright, so we have our top three sets of X's and we're ready to put in our loops. So right now I'm on this side of this corset, I'm going to come across diagonally and underneath. Then I'm going to come on the same side of the corset and down through the top. I don't need to pull the lace all the way through because I only need to finish lacing this corset. The rest of this ribbon becomes my pull loop. I'm going to do the same on the other side. So underneath diagonally first, and then down through the top on the same side of the corset. Pull a little bit out and bring the rest of my ribbon over here for my pull loop. All right, and we're just going to finish what we, just the same way we did on the top half. So underneath, underneath and diagonal. All right, over the top and diagonal. That X underneath diagonal. And over the top and diagonal. Once you get your corset fully laced, you take your ends and you 
just going to create a knot here. Didn't quite give myself enough ribbon to do that, did I? Make it work. Pull it through. And create your knot. And then you're just going to pull it like this. And there you have it. A bi-directionally laced corset ready to put on. Thank you so much for watching this video and we'll see you in the next one.